Hey guys, Vintage Gamer here with another mod showcase. And today we are doing the Rebel Rivals mod. So basically what this mod does is it adds a crap ton of weapons that are really destructive and awesome at the same time. So obviously I'm going to start with the boring stuff, save the best stuff for last. So we're just going to do some armor. None of There's a bunch of armor in the mod, but they're only creative only. They don't have any recipes. Like I'm wearing a set right now pretty cool looking but that's enough of that but um so this i don't know what this does i don't kakilo or whatever it's called to make that it's gonna be two cobblestone and two gravel and you will get five kakilos pliers are used for several things those will be later in the mod review but it's just two cobblestone and you get yourself a pliers and a sap or shovel it's two cobblestone any kind of sand any kind of dirt i mean one cobblestone, one gravel, and any kind of dirt, and sand. And you get with the sapper shovel. So I'm going to test how good the sapper shovel is. I'm just going to go into game mode zero. Oops. Alright, so we're going to test the sapper shovel. It should be a shovel. I mean, they would yeah, so it's a really fast shovel. Pretty easy to make. So I'm going to go back into creative. Alright. Now, to the, to the, there is a nuke in this mod. Now, I'll show you that stuff last. But now for the weapons. Okay, so there is several weapons in this mod. There's the plasma cannon, which I'll show you all the recipes right now. So the plasma cannon, it's going to be three hydrogen rods, which to make those is a bucket of water, bu bucket of water bucket, whatever. Rods, which to make those is steel, pliers, and I already showed you how to make pliers. And to make steel, it's four cobblestone, and you get 16 steel. And then after you make those, you have to make batteries. And to make those, it's gravel, sand, any kind of dirt, and cobblestone. And you get four batteries. And then it's just the three steel, and you will get yourself the plasma cannon. Now, it does require the hydrogen rods to fire it. But next, we have the M202 hack. To make this, you're going to need a hydrogen rod, a fuse, which to make that, it's a battery steel and two pliers and a nuclear rod a nuclear rod which I don't know how to get it doesn't have a recipe you guys can find that out for yourself pliers the M202RR which I'll show you how to make it in a second and then this it's gonna be four steel gas grenades which to make those it's gravel red sand any kind of dirt and cobblestone and you need two flares, which to make those you need fuel and rockets and any kind of dirt to make fuel. Oh my god, you have to get sand, gravel, cobblestone, and dirt. And to get the rockets, you need sand, gravel, cobblestone, and dirt. And then there's two dirt. And then you get the explosives. To get the ammunition, you need four rods, four steel, and pliers. And then I'll show you the recipe for this after. And then it requires rockets to fire. This is pretty much a combination of all of them. You just put three iron ingots, and nuclear rod, hydrogen rod, and a redstone rod. To make this, it's just redstone and the rod. And you get the rota, the gas grenade. I already showed you how to make that. This, it's made with three rockets, one battery, one pliers, and three steel. Sorry guys, this is going to take a while. <laughs> there is a lot of recipes in this mod, trust me. The Tesla, it requires batteries of fire, by the way. It's four batteries, pliers, and three steel. And at the, the thing under these weapons is what it requires to shoot. So, and the Einstein, 
The recipe for this is three redstone rods, a battery, pliers, and three steel. And it obviously requires redstone rods to fire. And the last one, the flamethrower, it's three fuel, a battery, pliers, and three steel. And you get yourself the flamethrower. And I already showed you how to make fuel. But if you want to make a nuke, which I'm going to get to in a second, you're going to need five steel and a pliers for the bottom and for the top. It's going to be five steel and pliers. But now let's test all the weapons. Since I'm in creative, I do not need what is required to fire it. And we're going to test this on some power, four iron golems. And I have made an addition to my mod showcase map. As you can see over here, made a little redstone. And I'm going to test the iron golems down here. Because I have like a little cave part that I can destroy. This is my little lab. And then this is where I'm going to be testing destructive stuff. And if it's really destructive, like way too destructive, it's going to be way far away from my lab out somewhere else, but let's get some iron golems to test this on. Okay, grab some iron golems. Because most of these are very powerful. But this one, I already know what it does. I'm not going to be testing down here because there's a purpose. I'll show you in a, reason, in a second. So, this is the flamethrower. And basically, what it does is does a crap ton of damage and it lights everything on fire and what this basically does is like settings alright the M2 hack I just hope that map was going to be awesome well I destroyed my map again well guys I guess I'm going to forget that Never mind, I'll rebuild my lab, but let's do this outside. I think I learned my lesson. Takes two seconds to rebuild anyway. Alright, now we can do the plasma cannon. So what this is, it you shoot it, you want to shoot it at their legs, and it like launches them in the air. Iron golems obviously don't take fall damage, so it doesn't affect them. With this one, it's like a mix of all three of them. It's really weird. And I just don't even know what happened. Yeah, I wouldn't mess with this thing because it's like really destructive and weird. Alright, so the gas grenades, if I could see. Just throw them and it gasses their enemies. This is like a um it's a little rocket launcher. This, the Tesla, does a crap ton of damage. Just like an electric thing, it did 65 damage right there. And lastly, the last weapon, before we do the finale, is the Einstein. Just like a laser that does a cap on the damage per second. And it amputates the mobs, which is really cool. Don't worry guys, I will fix my I have a backup world and I will uh fix my lab. Kinda destroyed part of it. But this is really awesome. This mod is really amazing. I'm not as mad as I was before when I destroyed something. Because it only got a part of it. At least it didn't like destroy my whole lab. And I could probably make something cool out of this. Actually, this would be sick. I'll do another video on it. I don't need to be talking about it right now. Let's not get distracted. I'll build something. Don't worry, guys. I'll fix it. But now the what you've all been waiting for the nuke so what you're gonna need for this nuke, I already went over the recipes for this but you're gonna need the time bomb which is a battery that's 
how you make that. Sorry guys, I'm a little glitched. For the chip, you're going to need a detonator and an antenna. Which, to get the detonator, it's going to be a battery, fuel, pliers, and a rocket. And for the nuclear rod, I don't know how to get that. And you're going to need an antenna, which is a detonator, a battery, pliers, and steel. And for a toaster, you're going to need seeds, pliers, a bucket of water, and steel. And you're going to need two of those. You're going to need a loader, which is a battery, six steel, and pliers. And you're going to need two batteries, and that will get you that chip. And this is basically all you need. But there's a point, like, you, the more hydrogen you put in it, I'll, I'll show you in a second. The more hydrogen you put in it, the bigger the explosion is. And we're going to go for a really big finale, make it really epic. And I will see you there. Alright guys, we're back for the finale. And we got 24 seconds. Just wait till it explodes. Don't worry, it's way far away from my lab. And I have a bed in there, so if I kill myself, I can just see where it is again. But here we go, for the finale. Ten seconds. Watch this, dudes. This is so awesome. This is like the si most sick weapon mod you ever see in your life. Look at that. I crashed. Hold on. We got to get the finale back up. Look, guys, look at this. This thing is gonna like completely destroy this. It it's different than other mods. It like loads at a time, so these blocks will eventually just start. It didn't work as it crashed. I'll do a small one so it doesn't crash. That's what it would look like, but. I think it's because I was recording, because normally when I do it, when I'm not recording, it does not crash like that. There we go. Wait, I have to get all the materials. Hold on, guys. Do we need this? Seriously? Alright guys, now we can get the legit finale. Ten seconds. But yeah guys, if, if you liked the video, hit that like button and that subscribe button for more daily content and gameplay. And I will see you later.